I'd like to explain what an arthrogram is. An arthrogram is a medical term for an injection into the joint. Your doctor has asked me or one of my partners to do this procedure so we can get a better look at the joint uh, with MRI. And it sounds like a scary procedure, but really it's not. I would like to tell you that I will tell you everything that I'm doing before I do it, so there won't be any surprises when we do the procedure. I use a very small needle to administer the local anesthesia, the numbing medicine. And most people say, and I'm being very honest here, that they either don't feel the needle stick at all, or it's really very, very minor. It's because we use a 25 gauge needle, that's a small needle. Once I give you the local anesthesia, you'll be nice and numb, and you won't feel uh, most of the procedure at all. I have the technologist put in some buffer into the local anesthesia and that takes away a lot of the sting. I don't know if you've been to the dentist's office before and remember what it feels like to get your mouth numbed up before a dental procedure. You know that it hurts a little bit when you get the local anesthesia. Well, I learned something from the dentist upstairs just uh, a few years ago and that is that if you put some bicarbonate or buffer into the local anesthesia, it takes the sting away. So that makes it a lot better. Once we get the joint nice and numb, then I'll inject a little bit of contrast into your joint and we'll take an x-ray and if everything is where it's supposed to be, then I'll take the needle out and we're done with the procedure. So it's a pretty quick procedure. It really doesn't take that long. Now with any medical procedure, there are risks and complications. With a joint injection, there are not too many risks and complications, but what they are uh, are as follows. Uh, there is the possibility that you might have an allergic reaction to the anesthesia or to the contrast. Uh, I haven't seen really an allergic reaction to contrast injected into the joint. I have seen it injected into the vein, but not injected into the joint, so it's a pretty safe procedure with respect to allergic reaction. If you have an allergy, especially if you know that you have an allergy to contrast, be sure and let me know, or my partner, whoever's doing the procedure, or the technologist. Second, uh, the other two possible complications are bleeding and infection. Uh, not really too much uh, of a problem uh, around a joint because there aren't big blood vessels that we have to worry about. Um, in most most joints, and uh, we'll take care to avoid those. And uh, infection uh, can be avoided if we practice sterile technique. So I hope that that uh, explains the procedure to you a little bit better, and I hope that it takes away some of the, the fear of uh, having to get an injection. By the way, I've had two joint injections myself, so I've done a lot of thinking about how uh, to make this not quite so scary and not quite so bad. Thanks very much. How about following the procedure? What to expect? Very good, very good. Now once the procedure's finished, your joint's gonna be nice and numb, and it'll be numb for about anywhere from three to four hours, and then the feeling will come back. And again, it'll be a lot like going to the dentist, where you feel kind of a tingly feeling, and then the feeling ends up coming back. Now, the night of the procedure, there's really a 50-50 chance that you will have some discomfort. It's really nothing to worry about. It is fairly common, but it's 50-50. There's a 50% chance you won't feel anything, and there's a 50% chance that you might have some discomfort. It'll feel like somebody maybe hit you uh, earlier in the day, and it's just kind of sore. Um, it will go away. Sometimes it takes up to a full day for it to go away, but it will go away. There's really nothing to worry about. If you do have discomfort, the best thing for it is an anti-inflammatory because it's an inflammatory reaction. So ibuprofen, a good dose, uh, maybe uh, six to 800 milligrams 
Uh, make sure you eat something, protect your stomach. Or a leave, one or two a leave, uh, will help uh, get rid of any discomfort that you might have because of the procedure. But again, it'll go away uh, given enough time.